So I had this guy just message me and said, oh, um, I see in one of your videos, you say you give your wife everything. Do you give her all your money too? Ha ha ha. Well, yes, I do, Kevin. I'll break it down for you. First of all, when you give a real woman anything, she's going to multiply and increase everything that you have given her. Example, you give her a kid, she's going to give you a family. You give her a house, she'll give you a home. You give her groceries, she's going to give you a meal. You give her a smile, she's going to give you all her love. But just remember, you give her any type of crap, just be ready to receive a bunch of shit because it goes both ways. And it's not a happy wife, happy life. It's happy spouse, happy house. So yes, I do give my wife my money and everything else. Because when we married, we became one. Stay blessed, my friends. In the high school, my mom and I would have a daily conversation about how weird I am. She'd be like, why can't you just be normal like the rest of your friends? I just fucking can't, mom. So I just moved to Calgary. Bigger than I thought it was. Bigger than I thought. They have this thing here called one-way roads. And I was not aware <laughs> of one-way roads. <laughs> I've driven down backwards twice. Yo, TikTok is cool and everything, but I just accidentally clicked on a hashtag that said peacocks, and then I watched an hour and 15 minutes of peacock TikToks. Like, bro, I don't even like peacocks. What the okay, I just had to start with that real quick because my wife showed me how to do that yesterday. I'm just trying to be a good husband, you know? Come here. Okay, I'm just gonna change real quick. There we go. Did you just talk about a girlfriend from the past? Oh, you heard that? Yo, yeah, yeah, I did. Oh, they existed. I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> terrible. <laughs> Yo, I'm shook. I was just minding my own business, running in the park, when what I thought was a grown ass man due to the full beard on his face approached me and said, hey, I really like your vintage sweatshirt. Where'd you get it? The event. I attended the 1996 Olympics in Atlanta. And then the worst part happened. He said, <laughs> I wasn't even born yet. What? Try TikTok, they said. It'll be fun, they said. Now I have a 15 second attention span. I have multiple personality disorder and I cannot stop following strangers. You all wanted it, so here it is. Instructions? Don't need those. Oh, that's warm. It's really warm. Mmm, that feels good. Mm -hmm. oh, oh boy. This is fabulous. <laughs> You know, you know what sucks? There's no backing out now. It's stuck to our face. <laughs> <laughs> I, I got it on the lip. One, two. Oh! oh! <laughs> oh! Fuck! So this is what we're, we we're do bleeding. TikTok. <laughs> Women definitely aren't sissy. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. We gonna do this? Got <laughs> this. <laughs> See ya. Hit it. That dude has to drive to Swanee.
Yeah, that's nice. Oh, that's good fork right there. God, God dang it. Mm-hmm. Got it right there. Mm, that, 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 that's the one. Mm-hmm. 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 Oh, I'm going to turn that off. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Go back. Go back. Yep. 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 Oh yeah. There, there, there we go. Where you go? Let's go. Wait till you fucking see this. Looks like a cabinet to me. It's just an old. Look at this. Anybody ever see one of those? Look at that. Now the young people on TikTok have never seen this, so you gotta explain it. It's an eight track. It's an eight track. Eight what track player? What year, big guy? Uh, seventies. You have four channels. <laughs> Fucking clean. And a turntable. You play records on that motherfucker. Okay, this is called a Brock string. It is one of the most fundamental vision therapy tools and you can easily make one at home. Just put a few beads on a string, tie the string to a doorknob, then put the string on your nose. What you are gonna wanna do is first focus on the closest bead to you. In my case, that's the yellow one. As you're looking at that bead, the string will cross at the yellow bead the other two beads will appear double. That's called physiological diplopia. You want that. If you can nail that, jump to the next bead. In my case, it's the green one. That will now be single. The string will cross at the green bead. The yellow and orange bead will now be doubled. Once you have that control, go to the next one. That will be the orange one. Strings crossing at the orange, double yellow, double green.